Hello, it's me, Christine. So this is how to use PayPal for memberships in Go High Level. I assume that you already connected your Light PayPal account to Go High Level. And um, the next thing to do is to add your product. So go to Payments, Products, then Create New Product. And then just for this one, we're just going to use Test, just for the sake of sample. And then Test again for the description. You can choose either Physical good, uh, Digital Goods or a service for this one i'll just choose service and then name it as a test again um and then for the product price let's just put 50 bucks so this is where it happens click on recurring then you will see the billing period you can choose either daily weekly monthly year or custom so i'm just going to use monthly and then click on the additional options then put a little bit of description just so they know what's that for number of payments one month two months three months then set a fees if you have one and then take on the membership offer so this is where you choose your membership offer so this one i have a marketing automation master class for high ticket so then create product the good thing about this is uh, as you can see it will automatically populate your offer both in your live and your test PayPal account, even in Stripe. So going back, the next thing for you to do is to go to sites. We'll just go ahead and create a sample, quickly create a funnel for this one. So let's just put test. All right. And then add new step. We're aiming for the two-step order form. So I'll just put uh, test. All right, then we can proceed with just creating a very simple funnel, just so we can show you how it works. One column, two step order, then hands. So go shipping, hide shipping, all right, just so it will be much faster. Then you can also enable your order bump here. And then step two. There you go. Save it. All right. The next thing we're going to do is make sure that we have the product inside our order, order page. So, all right. Go to products. Once you go, when, once you go back into your funnels, then add a product product name let's just say test all right then product just all right we did use test and then for the price we can just use the test one that's the one for 50 bucks and then additional options if you want to make this an order bump or not we're not choosing that one for this sample and then save then we can now go ahead and see the live version Let's just say this one, this one, and info. I'll just put my email. Right, then go to step two. There you go. You now have your PayPal. I hope that helps.